Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, which driver implementation will allow to run Selenium automation scripts in headless mode? Let me answer. There are two driver implementations, that is Chrome driver implementation and Firefox driver implementation, which will allow the Selenium to run the automation scripts in headless mode. First of all, what exactly is this headless mode? Let me explain that, okay? So, for example, I'll take the Chrome browser. So, Chrome browser, I'll say normal, normal mode, okay? Whereas, other side, I'll say Chrome browser, same Chrome browser, but in headless mode. What is the difference? The difference is very simple. When you run the scripts in Chrome browser, normal mode, you'll be able to visually see what's going on on the screen, like how the browser is launching, maximizing, opening the application URL, and uh, whatever the texting activities are being done. Visually, you can see everything on the screen. Okay, the browser and everything you can see along with the application and how the browser is closing, everything you can see visually. But coming to the Chrome headless mode, invisible mode, okay? Invisible. Scripts will be running in an invisible mode in the background, okay? You will not see anything happening on the screen, but the test will complete. Execution will complete by the time, okay? So let me show you practically how this visual mode and invisible mode looks like. For that, I'll switch to this Eclipse IDE where I have this sample Selenium automation code. Don't worry what code is available here. There is some sample Selenium automation code. Now, if I run the script like this, right click run as Java application, you will see that the browser will visually open. Browser will maximize. Browser will open the application URL. And after testing is done, browser will close. You see, visually we are able to see the browser and all. And we got the result. This is Chrome browser in normal mode, okay? What if I would like to run the scripts in headless mode? will not see anything happening, but the test will be done. Okay, invisibly the browser will launch and all, we will not see anything on the screen. So for that, for, uh, for Chrome driver implementation, we have to add this, okay? For the Chrome driver implementation, we have to add these two lines. Chrome options, options is called new Chrome options, like that we have to add. It's called new Chrome options. <clears throat> now, hover the mouse on this Chrome options and uh, import it from Selenium. Now say options dot add arguments. And here put double quotes and in this give an argument known as type on type on headless, right? So after the, writing these two lines, one more thing you have to do that is copy these options and paste it here in the constructor. Then only this headless mode thing will be applied to this Chrome driver implementation. Okay. If you don't provide these options where headless mode is set in this constructor, then things are not going to work. Now run this script, right click run as Java application. Observe that. You'll not see anything happening on the screen, okay? In invisible mode, the script will run. You'll not see the browser launching, maximizing and all. You see, already you got the result without the browser coming up on the screen, okay? This is what is a headless mode. Hope you got the idea. But why people go for the headless mode? Because the scripts are faster. The scripts will run faster. There is no need of, uh, you know, uh, loading the UI, okay? Loading the UI on the screen. So the scripts are a lot of faster. There are a lot of... Uh, uh, they will execute with uh, good speed, okay? Otherwise, okay? They will run faster or they will get, uh, they will execute with good speed, okay? That is a headless mode. That's not nothing but headless mode. Coming here, the, the scripts are a bit slower than the headless mode, right? Because visually, visually we have to see. So grab GUI need to be loaded of the browsers and application. So they will be a bit slower than. So when people want to run the scripts in a faster way, they may go for the headless mode. And uh, one more reason, Maybe like in the same machine, okay, in the same machine, you want to run your scripts at the same machine, you have some work. While the scripts are running, you want to do your work. So in case of visually, they, you will get interrupted, right? Every time you run the scripts, uh, the browsers will keep launching and they will disturb you. But in headless mode, that will not happen, okay? While you're working, the scripts are running in the background in invisible mode, okay? Those are the two advantages of uh, people going for the Chrome browser or uh, Firefox browser headless mode. Similarly, you can go with the Firefox browser also. Firefox driver implementation also. Firefox driver, I will say, over the most. And uh, if I remove these options and uh, remove this part, first I will show you how the scripts are running in uh, normal Firefox browser mode. We have, it's not headless mode, it's a normal mode, okay? You will see the Firefox browser launching, maximizing, and all the stuff in this case. You'll see the Firefox browser launching. You see Firefox browser is launching. It'll maximize. Open the application URL, you can see everything happening on the screen. Testing will be done, close. We got the result here. 
got the result here. Now, what if I would like to run the same thing in a headless mode, Firefox browser, headless mode, Firefox options, options is equal to new, Firefox options like this. Import this Firefox options. Now say options dot, options dot add arguments. Here provide in double quotes, provide hyphen hyphen it, hyphen hyphen get this. Now copy these options and paste in the constructor of the Firefox driver. Now run the script. You'll see that the, uh, the scripts will run in the Firefox browser headless mode. You see, the scripts are running in the Firefox browser headless mode now, right? You have uh, like uh, visually nothing came. Let me run it again. Visually nothing came on the screen. No Firefox browser, nothing. You see, I'm running it again. You will not see anything on the screen. Directly you will get the result. You see, you got directly got the result. Okay. So this is what is uh, running in the scripts in headless mode uh, in Selenium. This driver implementations that is Chrome driver and Firefox driver are the two implementations which are allowing to run the scripts in Atlas mode. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye bye.